I think the thing uh, I am most proud of in my time as the commanding general of Maryland Defense Force is the complete change of culture from that of a ceremonial unit that uh, that just provided uh, ceremonial services to a unit that is one that is operationally focused that we are providing uh, services to the state in an emergency. We have focused ourselves on uh, that our contingency mission is uh, supporting the state in times of disaster and we've done that. Hurricane Irene, uh, Hurricane Sandy, uh, we deployed MDDF soldiers over to the eastern shore so we were a full uh, partner with the rest of the Maryland Military Department, the Air Guard and the Army Guard in providing uh, uh, services to the state. We provided engineer assessment services. Uh, other places where we become significantly more operational is in our 10th Medical Regiment. We actually have deployed a mobile hospital over to the um, eastern shore uh, two times each year in support of events. And this has been a full hospital. It provided hospital services uh, so that uh, athletes who were doing a triathlon could be treated there instead of having to be sent to the hospital. The hospital was brought to them and, and it was very successful and it made us more ready should we have to use those services in a major disaster. But every one of our units has become more operational and more uh, ingrained into the state and into the Maryland Military Department in many different ways, uh, whether they're the financial personnel, the the judge advocate generals who have gone and done, uh, who, who represent guardsmen in court uh, when they can't afford to do that on many different services. The more we rub shoulders with national guardsmen and personnel and our people in the state, the more they know who we are. You know, it was a wonderful when this past summer with the uh, celebration of the War of 1812 and the defense of Baltimore in 1814 we had our band, we were fully ingrained, we were fully up into camp, uh, not camp, but into Fort McHenry where we uh, provided uh, security services, medical services, and uh, the band played providing musical services. And, and people would come up and say, who are you? What, why do you do this? You know, tell me more about the Maryland Defense Force. So we are getting our name out, our brand out, and, and we're becoming more of a known commodity and that's really uh, was one of my goals.